So I was going through the comments for the last video and you guys have some overwhelming amount of support and I do appreciate all of that. Seems like you guys really like my tutorial so I might just keep up doing that for you guys. But I saw this comment and the name. This guy's pretty cool. Alrighty, so all jokes aside, hello everyone. I am here on the Trove and I have been reading all of your guys' comments or at least most of them. I'm tr I try to like look through all of them and a lot of you really like my tutorials. So I think what I'll do is I'll play the game a little bit differently. I used to just play this game strictly for just trying to be max in general. So like right now I am number... I I'm tied for fourth right now and realistically I could try to push for number one, but I don't think I'm just going to do that anymore because like I'll just go at my own pace pretty much and I think that way the game will be less stale. So like at least when I hop on stream, I'll have something to do rather than just me doing dungeons and not really, you know, making progress with that or anything. And apart from that, obviously I want to help you guys. So I will be doing more build tutorials, more like other tutorials that you guys will find handy. I can do things like how to get dragons really quick, how, how to, uh, I think I already did an XP level up, but I can do other character builds. I know uh, someone in, in my comments section really wanted a Draco build. I could uh, do that. But yeah, I don't really play this game like every day. I do, like I said earlier, or in my last video, I do play other games. I do want to focus on other stuff, but uh, the main reason why I st still stay on this game, I guess, is because like a while back, I always wanted to be good at one specific game. And whereas this game doesn't really require a skill at all, uh, you can still technically be number one in a case. So in my case, mastery, I could also try to push for my power rank. I can try to get top 10 for this one. And I know I'm capable of doing it. I do have a lot of bound brilliance now, so I should be able to do that. And I think I'm just going to play this game at my own pace. And because of that, I don't think I want to fully quit this game because I have put in a lot of time and effort. Like, I can't tell you how long it took me to grind out these mementos. Like... These things are a pain to do. I have all of them. And not only that, but I also had to do the banners, which are here. But I have two more here that I have to get, and these aren't going to be too bad to get. Uh, this one might take me a while to get, actually. But yeah, I don't have anything too complicated left to do to get back to rank one for Trove Mastery. But yeah, I still stick by that. I do really want to be good at one specific game. And I have gotten really far in this game where I could actually provide you guys tips and tricks on what not to do. So like the, everything that I messed up on, I can tell you guys what you should be doing and what you should be grinding for. And hopefully that helps you guys out. So I think in terms of that, I might just stick around because I do like giving tips. Uh, I really do enjoy that, like especially something I'm good at. Like I feel like I'm pretty knowledgeable about Trove where I could help out any new players or any mid-game players, even end-game players. But uh, that's just for Trove. I do want to adventure out into other games and maybe post some of that on my channel, but I'm not 100% sure yet. Like I do play Rocket League on the side and I'm not like standout amazing at it, but I do want to play that. I do want to stream it as well. I do play Osu. I want to get really good at Osu as well, but... You know, there's other games that out there that I want to do. I don't think I'll make videos for Osu specifically, but uh, it is worth a shot to just like, you know, stream it and see what happens if you guys enjoy it. But yeah, I'm like really picky on games. A lot of my friends know about this, but like if you guys tell me to play a new game, there's a really, really good chance that I'll say no to it just because I just like playing the games that I already have. Another thing that I play is Genshin Impact. Uh, I just kind of, I don't really grind it too much. I just kind of play it on the side. Like I'll do my commissions, my dailies on there. Uh, spend my resin on something and then I'll just log off of the game. But yeah, just reading your guys' comments, uh, it really seems like you guys like my tutorials and they seem helpful to you guys. It's just like straight to the point type thing, which I like personally. So like I remember watching back, uh, like this was back in my COD days or just like a really long time ago, people would put out tutorials and never get straight to the point. Like even now people do this. So I guess that's just some advice. If you're a YouTuber out there or want to grind out content creation, uh, keep note of that. If you're spending the first like eight minutes talking about, I, I, that, that's kind of exaggerating. Let's just say you talk about something for two minutes, like your intro, and then you get to the point like in the next minute, like you spent that two minutes, like, you know, your, your audience is kind of waiting to get to what your title is all about. And I've watched a lot of tutorials back in the day, and a lot of people just spend a lot of time on their intro. I just go straight to the point. I just say, hello, what's up? If something comes up, I'll just talk about it real quick. And if there's anything else I want to add, maybe I can add it to the outro. 
Okay, anyway, let's get back on track for a little bit. So I did talk about Trove. I think I'm just going to stick to Trove tutorials and try to help you guys out. And I think, you know, Trove has gotten me really far in this channel and you guys have been very supportive and I do like giving out tips. So as far as that goes, I will do that for Trove. And apart from that, uh, let me guys know if you want to see any other games from me because I do play Rocket League, I do play Osu, and I do play Genshin Impact. But as far as content goes, like if I'm going to upload something on YouTube, I'm probably just going to do Rocket League because Osu, I don't really make any standout plays, uh, if that makes sense. Like a lot of really good players in the game are getting at least 700 PP on something. And I'm like, I find 200 PP plays impressive if I set one. So I probably won't be uploading stuff like that. For Genshin Impact, there's not really anything for me to upload there either. I'm just like an average player, I guess. But for Rocket League, oh boy, let me tell you this. I am not a pro at that game, but but I do play with a certain someone. And that certain someone, I'm sure is watching this video right now. And uh, we are pretty high up there in ranks and it's, you know, we have to, I have two different accounts. One account is me playing Rocket League with him, and that's just like our learning account, quote unquote, because my friend's really good at Rocket League, but I'm not type thing. So I have to learn to get better, build up my mechanics, and just overall get better at the game so we can improve together. Because uh, if I just solo queue, I think I'm a diamond at best. For twos, that is. For ones, I'm maybe just about diamond. I actually don't really play threes, but I could try that out at some point. Or what I could do is have tutorials like uploaded for Trove like I usually do and then maybe like a double upload type thing. Uh, you guys could get like a bonus for like, you know, Rocket League stuff. Or I could also stream it. That's a possibility as well. Let me know what you guys think. Or, or we could do a Road to Grand Champ series on Rocket League. That would be pretty fun. Uh, I'm not good enough at the game, but I can get, I can only get better at that game. Also, uh, just a quick note, I, I just realized I was farming with death defying this entire time. I, I forgot to put on conjures, but you know, it's okay. We're just, uh, we're making a chill, chill video here. But yeah, let's continue growing together. You guys are absolutely amazing. And let's see what the future holds for us. So on that note, if you liked the video, drop a like, subscribe if you are new. If you want to be responsible for the next video, you can drop something down in the comments down below. And I will do my best to do it. But yeah, on that note, I will see you guys later.